Our warming planet is taking a toll on freshwater fish in lakes and streams across the country. Meteorologist Jen Carfagno has more on the future of freshwater fishing. I've been fishing since I was probably about six years old. Most everyone remembers catching their first fish. And we've all heard the stories of the one that got away. There's just something about being out on the water that's ingrained in our culture. It is a zen-like experience. Fly fishing is, there's nothing quite like it. It's, it's becoming one with the river. But now, freshwater fishing in the U.S. is being threatened. And the culprit is climate change. Anyone who's ever owned a, a goldfish knows that fish can be really sensitive to temperature. So even as the air is warming, the water is warming too. A new report out by the National Wildlife Federation warns that warming temperatures are harming freshwater fish in lakes and streams and a great American tradition. The thing that's so incredible about fishing, it's about family. Fishing is one of the you know, longest held traditions here in the United States. And so these kinds of uh, family experiences are the, exactly the sorts of things that we're worried about with climate change. Scientists say just a small rise in temperatures can have serious impacts. A, a big problem for fish is that they will become isolated in these smaller pools of water that remain. Um, and, and so they don't have as much opportunity to move around to find so sort of cooler um, uh, spots within the water where they can find some refuge. Experts say curbing harmful emissions and reducing other environmental stressors is key to protecting our freshwater fish and all the benefits they provide. It's a wonderful pastime. It's a pastime that's been around for centuries. And hopefully if we do the right things and we take care of, of the environment, hopefully it's a pastime that will last for generations to come. I'm meteorologist Jen Carfagno.